Good. So it's a beautiful day here at the Maine Forest and Logging Museum. Uh, we've done a lot, there's a lot of volunteers out working, doing social distancing, etc. Uh, we were able to get the water powered sawmill, uh, did a test run on that to work the saw a little bit, make sure it survived the winter okay. We got the make and break Fairbanks Morse running, which really, really pleased us. That's a great addition to the museum. We've also spent some time working on the 1928 dump truck. So one of the things we had with the dump truck was uh, the water temperature gauge wasn't working. And what we found out was the temperature probe itself wasn't attached to anything. And there's no fitting in the block, there's nothing. So we ended up actually having to make a fitting. So you can see right here, we've got the, uh, the line coming in from the gauge. Uh, we took a piece of uh, pipe a two inch pipe and made a fitting and turned a seat for the probe to sit on so it's all watertight and then soldered it all together, cut the hose and put it back. Now my cut's not exactly, you know, clean but it works and it doesn't leak. And now we've got a full set of working gauges in the 1928 Lombard which makes us very happy. Any day we can work on mold machinery like this is a good day. a fantastic day. So uh, we got the temperature gauge working on the uh, 1928 Lombard dump truck. We got the three horsepower uh, uh, Model Z Fairbanks Morris up and running. That was fun. We got the uh, the water powered sawmill run for the first time. We shot a video about the uh, rotary powered sawmill. We just drove a little over a mile with the uh, dump truck. Um, it's absolutely running fantastic. We Our top speed is about five miles an hour, but might as well be going a thousand. Um, very, very, very good day. Not many places you can have a day like that. But right here at the Maine Forest and Logging Museum, you can do that, which is amazing. Pretty good and we're day. We're always looking for volunteers. <laughs>